And welcome back folks, welcome back to Let's Play Fallout. <sighs> yeah, last time we were in a situation that was a bit complicated. Namely this man, Killian Darkwater over there, decided to kill all the customers of Gizmo's Casino. We were trying to arrest Gizmo. There you can see his remains. And then this arrest degenerated into a slaughter fest. So this was one problem. And the second problem was that I accidentally hit Killian Darkwater. I mistook him for an enemy. So now he wants to kill us too. Yeah. So that's bad. Um, I guess we have to deal with it. Or do we? Because I'm going to do something which you will not like. I'm going to reload. Because screw this. I didn't actually intend um, to hit Killian Darkwater, so I, I'm just going to assume that this never happened. Of course, this means that I will have to do this whole dialogue shenanigans again. You see a disgusting excuse for a man. This must be Gizmo. On the plus side, it will mean that we will actually be able to choose a better dialogue option when we when we will speak to uh, Kilian. Yeah, so let us go through this dialogue want? again. I'm, a busy man. I'm here to talk about the attempt on Killian's life. What you're talking about. Uh, take Such it, as, blah, blah, blah. We'll say. Let me guess. You're that someone. Hmm. Well, how can I trust you? Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. That's easy. Yeah. I want him dead because he cramps my good. Okay. We got the quest to kill Killian. Now we. Get thrown out. Now we we'll talk to Lars again. Which means going all the way back to the very... No, we go actually go to Kilian, uh, Which means not going back to the beginning of this level, but going back to this. Um, this building here. And this pathing takes a while. Yeah, I'm very sorry that I reloaded there. But as I said, um, okay, I'm just said that I will generally not reload, but I said that I would reload um, if, for instance, I misclicked, and in this case, I did. So, so, did you get the evidence? Which bugger tape? Let's hear it. Okay, that's the first time yeah. I've been happy to hear his voice. Thanks, friend. Now, time for you and me to take care of the other business. Yeah, that other business. Let us be not so stupid as we were last time. Let us actually take some stim packs. Well, thanks again. Well, listen, I'm going to take the guards and run Gizmo and his cronies uh... out of town. I could use another gun. You up for it? Yeah, I... Might be good not sure um, where we, he will actually agree to give you some reward, but I don't think actually... He would, so let's go with go that to option. Lars at the yeah, now we go to Lars again. Who is at the very big... Who is at the entry of this level? Yeah, the second reason why I reloaded was... If I didn't, I would have to... I would have had to kill Killian. And also all the guards in this town. And we earned 500 experience for getting the confession. Um, and that means that we might not be able to complete the second quest. So let's talk to Lars. Uh, yeah, you bet. Let's nail that up. Okay, let's let's do it. Okay. Um, who is that, by the way? Is this me? No, I don't think so. That is actually, I think, his bodyguard. Um, let us take 
care of Kilian. By the way, um, I noticed something. Okay, good thing I didn't attack him because that was one of the guns. His bodyguard actually is nowhere to be found, it seems. Um, yeah, I think that I noticed. I think that actually when I use the brass knuckles, that... And he's dead. That was quick. Um, when I use the brass knuckles, um, that actually counts as, me as a melee weapon and not as unarmed combat. So I, I think I do much more damage if I use the, if I go for unarmed combat, not use the brass knuckles. So I won't use them. However, I shall steal all your stuff except these iguanas on the stick, which I really don't care about. Okay, let us... Uh, yeah. Actually, end combat, because I think we've killed all the hostiles. Thanks for all your help. Here are 500 caps. You're always welcome in junk town, friend. Gained 300, we gained 300 experience for killing... Gizmo and 600 for, yeah, for whatever. So 900 points in experience. Um, yeah, there's nothing we can say to Lars. Let us go back. Um, well, actually, there's no reason to go back to go back to Kilian. So we're, we are pretty much done here at Junk Town. There's only one quest left. And that would be the quest to bust the Skulls King. Um, yeah, and there's something to do at the hospital also. But we should maybe try to remember that we are actually sent on a quest. Blah, not on a quest. What's a quest? On a quest. On a quest of our own. Which is sort of important. I mean, we have to... Uh, we have to rescue all. We have to rescue our people from a horrible, a horrible death by um, not starvation. Okay, what? Or do you say starvation? Okay, from dehydration. A horrible, a horrible death by dehydration. Okay, let's loot. Um, the remains of Izzo. Yeah, he, has, he has some stim packs and some brass knuckles which are actually better than the ones we have, I think. These do... Yeah, they do much more damage than those. Um, so I guess we should sell them at some point. There's still something to do here. Um, there is this door. That is locked. And I'm going to... I'm going to save. And if you wonder... Why there's always a save game... Already a save game there. That's because... Yeah, I already... Um, recorded a video but then decided not to use it. So let us try to break into that room. Using our lock picking skill. The problem with the lock picking skill is if it fails you can actually break the lock. In this case we were we were successful. Um, sometimes you just fail to pick the lock then you can try again. But sometimes you actually break the lock and then you are really screwed. Okay, there's a bag. Let's check that bag. Uh, this bag contains 100 bottle caps which, which we shall take. There's a lighter, a silver Bhutan lighter in good condition, and there is a a gun rack, rack, a magazine devoted to the practical use of firearms, and the occasional bias review. Let us read this magazine and see it magically being read away. 
Hmm, in the bo box of noodles. You have no idea what instant spaghetti means. Um... Did I drop it? Yeah, I dropped it. Okay, that's good to know that... Oh. And I also... Okay, this is something I should, I should remember. When you pick on... When you click on the hand symbol, you actually drop things. So I just dropped that bottle. I just dropped these 100 bottle caps. How, um... Although I thought I would, so sort of, yeah, t just take them out of the bag and put them into my collection of bottle caps. Yeah, there are some more magazines that we actually can read, like this survival handbook. It should grant us nine points in outdoors, man. Yeah, we should. Yeah, and we are still lacking some. Uh, 200 points before we can get to the next level. Okay, this was empty, okay? Uh, there is still uh, a dresser in this room containing nothing at all. Okay, let's leave. Let's leave Gizmo's private bedroom. I don't dare trying to search his uh, it's bad. And I think I searched this bookcase also. Or did I? Yeah, I searched this bookcase. Okay. Let's leave then. Let us leave. Um, yeah. By the way, is this bar finally open? The bar where I got attacked by Shark. Then I blinded him. No. Okay, maybe it will be open when it's evening. Maybe then it will... Yes, I think it's now open. Yeah. And there are some people. Uh, you see Trish. Waitress from the Scumpit. Can I talk to her? Welcome to the Scumpit. Can I get you something to drink? Uh, why not? What do you have? Hmm. Let's have a beer. Here you go. Enjoy. And someone who is very... Or just Ian. Can I ask you some questions then? I guess so. Uh, who owns the bar? Nigel owns the bar. He's a good guy. Oh, sorry, it's supposed to be a woman. Nigel owns the, owns the bar. He's a good guy. Always treated me right. We used to date, but he got a little too serious for my liking. I don't, I don't want to be a widow. Thanks, bye. Can I ask you some more questions? Who is Gizmo? Gizmo runs the casino. Actually, he's dead. He would like to take over Neil's bar, but D Neil doesn't want to sell. Keelan and Gizmo do not like each other. One of them will either have to leave town or be buried beneath it. Okay. I think that's everything that we get out of her. You see dirt. No. Yeah, you see dirt, a member of the Skulls gang. You're on Skulls, Turf Stranger. You better leave. Uh, I don't think so, actually. I think that's a bar that I am perfectly, um, yeah, allowed to be in. So when we come back, folks, we shall continue to be in the scum pit and talk to these nice people here of Shady Sands. So not not Shady Sands, whatever. Talking about Junk Town, of course. So until next time, folks. Until then.